What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We're doing another uh, <clears throat> Cons Expanded Cube Draft, which have been pretty fun, actually. I'm, uh, I'm enjoying this cube quite a bit. Well, it's 5.30, 5.30 in the morning. Unbelievable. Oh, three? Rune Cape. Come on, buddy. You're better than that. I think. Maybe. I'd like to think so. All right, what do we got here? Let's check it out. Triangle of War. Sacrifice it. Sacrifice your. F you control fights a creature an opponent controls. Yeah, all right, that's exciting. I like Duplicate and I like Anavolver in this cube. Duplicate seems like there's a lot of problematic creatures that are <clears throat> easily handled by a Duplicate. Also, Anavolver is <clears throat> pretty nice. Becomes a six-six flying regenerator. Not too bad, not too bad. Um, on a wintry Saturday morning, Saturday morning. Yeah, I think Duplicate is the pick as well. However, Runa Cape, you did just go 0-3, oh, so maybe not. Icarus, thank you so much for the reset. Really appreciate it, buddy. Welcome back. Welcome back. I'm gonna take Duplicante. Are you a Duplicant or are you dupl are you a Duplicant? That's really what you have to ask yourself, I think. <clears throat> And let me, let, me know, let me know how that goes for you when you ask yourself that. Um, I'm looking for, like, build-arounds. Trail of Mystery was great yesterday. I don't actually love Sidisi. I'm really... I'm, I'm, I'm apprehensive of milling myself in the cube. Find Finality is pretty good. It seems like it's actually great in this, in this format. Like, you just... Wipe out all their dudes or get two guys back. I think it's I mean I think it's probably better than Trail of Tears, right? Trail of Mystery. Wow, Trail of Tears. Yikes. <clears throat> Injecting a little real world history in here. Oh, cause you know, sometimes you just have to donate ten subs. Badger, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. I hope it's not too wintry over there in Australia in July. Yeah, I'm gonna take the find finality. Thank you. I'm a du duplicante, not quite your average du du salsa. Wow, that's something. That was something right there. Thank you. 5.30 is a good time for some subs. That's when most of the subs are online. 5.30. This card was, was doing some work against us yesterday. <clears throat> I'd be interested in trying it ourselves. Uh, whenever an octagon creature, whenever you cast an octagon creature spell, you may, uh, pay two to give a creature double strike. That's fine. Brian Elemental, also good, especially if we get uh, Vesuvian Shapeshifter. Then it's just a lock. <clears throat> Thank you. Is it 50 degrees in July? That's pretty weird, right? Thank you. That seems weird. Badger, thank you. I think I like Silent Spectre better than Brian Elemental. It's great on its own. Oh, Muldrotha. Wow, I'm a Muldrotha. Get yourself a nice Rhino. Was that it? Does that do it? Wow, you guys are amazing. Wow, we did it. <clears throat> thank you so much. Kerwood, buddy, you are awesome, my dude. But Kai, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. That almost got lost. In the, I actually think that was that was by that was that was that was an independent sub, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Yeah, but Kai, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. it. Almost got lost in the gifted subs. Yeah, Muldroth is actually insane. Of course, there's a lot of six drops, so don't forget this is a. Uh, it's your boy. It's your morph boy. I think we're gonna. T oh, Voracious Hydra is very good. Oh, that's interesting. Like we're being salty, but we're not like super concerned with the graveyard. How is it this cold in July? That's what I don't understand. Explain it to me like I'm stupid. Maybe he is stupid. 
I really want to take this land because I think fixing is very, very important. Voracious Hydra is very, very good, though. I'm going to take the Voracious Hydra. It's probably one of the greedier things I could do. Now I want to take this Mystic Snake because, <clears throat> come on. Come on, guys. You know me. I've actually been enjoying the cube so far. Surprisingly. Like, I mean, surprisingly because a lot of times the, uh, the more off-brand cubes are not uh, super... Like, sometimes they're just a little too out there. They're not exactly what you're looking for. But, um... No, this was great. I feel like it has enough... There's enough play. There's enough things to do. There's enough power, but there's also... It's not, like, super overwhelming. Bloodstained Mire could be good. Dreg Mangler could be good. My ear is itching. I'm not, like... I'm not, like, picking my ear. I just have an itch, like, right on the edge here. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> Um, I like Impulse. I do like Bloodstained Mire. Like, if we can get lands to search for it, this is great. Ash Barons is probably better than a lot of these other cards, I think. Yeah, I like Ash Barons. Basic land cycling is pretty powerful here. Grand Coliseum. I mean, that's also good for fixing. Sure. My drink is not coasting yet. I have yet to, I haven't opened the coasters yet. I will definitely be trying them out, though. <clears throat> like, I am a... Like, we went over this coaster thing the other day, and I'm definitely a fan of good coasters. But, like, I'll use any coaster when it comes down to it. Wow, the Sidisi came back? Alright, well, now we're just taking Sidisi. I paid some level of attention in geography class. Oh. <laughs> Australia's in the Southern Hemisphere, and the Southern Hemisphere seasons are opposite of ours. So when it's summer here, it's winter. No, get out of here. That sounds crazy. Well, I hope you passed all your geography classes. Classes. Okay. Oh, we did stomping ground. Uh, stomping ground lets Bloodstained Mire get a green, which is pretty interesting. So it's actually not terrible for us. Uh, yeah. Actually, I don't mind ambush. Commit to memory is also pretty good. I think I like commit better in our deck. Phantasmal, sure. Hey, look, the card that should be banned in modern. Should be banned in modern. Uh, Sansep Citadel is two colors. I think I like Solemn here, though. Solemn Simulacrum just seems great in this format. Yeah, I think commit is really flexible too, uh, and especially if we mill it or something, we just get a, it's a it's a spell. I also hope vicious if vicious offering comes back, I'd be grateful. That'd be cool. Uh, I don't think we want to do dead bridge, dead bridge chant again. Dead bridge is great, but like we already have a bunch of six drops, and I'm not trying to <clears throat> not trying to live or die on the on the six drop train, whatever that means. And there is. All right, and I updated the rent goal too. So, there you go. Now we're doing it. <sighs> I wish there were some cheaper creatures. I mean, there's this. Meh. Tripodus doesn't seem terrible. Uh, it's definitely super choppy right now, and I don't actually know why. I'm dropping a bunch of frames, so if you guys are watching on Twitch... I apologize. I do apologize. I'm just going to take the 
the noose. Nope, not just you. I blame my superior uh, spectrum internet. That's what I. That's what I attribute it to. Evolving wilds. I, mean, I already have Ash Barons and Grand Coliseum and Dismal Backwater. Like all of our lands are just gonna come into play tapped. But like, there's not really much better in this pack. Strategic planning is actually not terrible. Especially with Muldratha or Sadisi. Is this whenever one of our creatures are printed from your library? Okay. Yeah, it's probably just planning. I don't think I care about uh, <clears throat> Evolving Wilds much. Is there... Am I missing something? Is there a reason why am I... Okay, VPN's not on. Yeah, I don't know. This is actually pretty miserable. Uh, I actually like Filigree Familiar. It's probably the best card in this pack. Whenever you cast an instant sorcery, tap a creature and control. That creature doesn't tap turns. That card seems good. I mean, it's four mana, and our four mana slot's a little bit heavy right now, but... How about a card called Solemn Grimulacrum? Uh, let me highlight this. Where when it comes into play, you get to search your library... Uh, you you get to search a card from your library and put it into your graveyard, and when it dies, you get to put the card. That's actually interesting. Uh, you wouldn't. It's it's difficult to track a card like that though, because you'd have to remember which card you put in your graveyard. So usually you'd want to have like counters and things for something like that, or you'd want to like exile the card, and then the card goes into your graveyard, or goes into your hand rather. Um. Yeah, this is fucking miserable. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> Could just be Air of the Wilds. I think Air of the Wilds is fine. Stubborn Denial also fine. Didn't I just see this guy? I don't know. They did say there were going to be repeats in the queue. Wow, I feel like all these lands are telling me I should be Grixis. Based on creatures, whenever a permanent you control is turned face up, draw a card. We got one, two... Just two so far. Creekwood Ghoul actually pretty strong from what we've seen. Oh, uh, another Legacy League? Um, probably whenever we find a deck that's sweet and... Well, this is two of our colors. I did want the Vicious Offering, though. Yeah, I like Vicious Offering a little better. Oh, interesting. Search library for a card and put it in your graveyard when it dies. You get to put a card from your graveyard in your hand. Yeah, that sounds great. Yeah, so this, this connection's pretty shit. Unfortunately. Not really sure what to do with though, guys. <coughs> I guess I'll sneeze. Uh it's being your instant opponent attack the creator and target Yeah, that card's actually fine. Sammy, what's going on, buddy? Exidor. We've dropped 7,700 frames so far, and I have literally no no idea why. It's actually infuriating. Why do I pay for this internet service? I don't know. You got me.
Watery Grave seems nice. Settings, stream. Let's try it again. All right, we're trying to restart the stream here. Definitely taking watery grave here. We need some fixing. Ideally, I don't know. The only thing we care about here is like debilitating injury. <clears throat> I'm not even sure this is actually gonna could not access okay well we're gonna stop the recording and then we'll probably splice this together because that's what we should do in 2019 all right let's see if this works no idea if it will we're immediately dropping frames so probably not but either way I guess we get to at least record the video so that's cool that's cool I'll we'll just take callous dismissal here oh dragon lord silumgar that's a six drop worth taking Foul Renewal also very good. Oh, Sagamala can go in the three job spot. That actually makes me feel better. Yeah, no idea. No idea why it's doing this. Would love a breeding pool or an overgrown tomb. Opulent Palace. I'll take it. Sultai Soothsayer is great. Dang it. I think we take the Opulent Palace and maybe the Soothsayer can come back. It's definitely not any better now, unfortunately. Rakshasa Vizier uh, seems very, very good. Well, I actually just, I actually literally um, stopped the stream and restarted it, so that was me, not the... I think it's just Rakshasa Vizier. This card seems very, very strong. And it's a cat demon. How do you go wrong? Expunge? Ah, eh, maybe I'm taking the expunge. Maybe the demon comes back. Expunge is strong removal. It even cycles if you needed to. That's pretty good. Thousand wins is nuts. Busted up on us pretty good the other day. Temple of Deceit? I like that. I like that. I mean, now we have Water of Dizzleback Water and Temple of Deceit. We have a lot of blue black lands. Could the heat have anything? No, because it's been raining all day. And all yesterday. Temperature is literally like 70 degrees here or something. 79, yeah. It's, it's definitely not a heat issue. Coiling Oracle. For sure. Actually, we don't have many Conclave Naturalist effects, right? Yeah, I think I just want this guy. Nope, nope, nope. Well, this pack's rough, but Ruthless Ripper is a card. Kills the thing. Wow, 218 kilobytes, up to 2100 kilobytes, up to 3200 kilobytes, down to 2600 kilobytes, down to 600 kilobytes, up to 2200 kilobytes. The fucking, the, the range of these kilobytes is actually insane. Like, it's utterly ridiculous. I'm really just, I, I, like, I really hope, I'm like, oh, is, am I doing something wrong? I never know. Uh, Infest is actually a card that we have could have had it well in the, in the first draft we did. Could have had it well. What does that even mean? <laughs> Discard two cards and draw three cards. I mean, you're a card. Sure.
There are a lot of blue cards in our sideboard. What did I take over Dig? I thought it was something good. Cloud form. I like one playable shy. That's interesting. Yeah, but then I have to stop the stream again to try another Twitch server, so. It's also on automatic, so it should be finding the best one. Anyway, I guess we'll try it. Nope, still basically unwatchable. Still dropping 50% of the frames that we're using, so... I guess this is just my fucking life now, so... Thank you guys for dealing with it, if you are, and if not, I understand. So, that's cool. We have Deranged Assistant and Quarcy Deceiver. Hmm, that's pretty good. Wow, down to zero kilobytes. Wow, that's great. This is just fantastic. It's a solid internet infrastructure for a multi-billion dollar company, I imagine. Solid, solid infrastructure. Oh, God. It's like the cringiest. It's just extremely frustrating when this is your job and, like, you have to do this and then you have to uh, no, slash 26 4 p.m. well good times good times we have to actually add one more card we target a we turn target creature with a morph ability face down that's interesting I don't know if I care about it Hmm. I almost don't mind Stubborn Denial here. We don't have a ton of creatures that would trigger it, though. Moldratha and Conclave Naturalists. And I guess these guys, if they're flipped... Actually, Ruthless, Ruthless Ripper seems good as far as, uh... Oh, wow, all of our lands are playable. That's great. Okay, so... Uh, let's move you guys over here. You can go over here. You're a blue card. I don't know why you're in the other pile. Okay, so for black sources we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I'll say 8 for now just to be on the generous side. Green sources we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, uh, I can deal with that for now. Blue sources we have 1, 2, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Let's go down to nine here, up to nine here, up to eight here. And I still get two more? Jeez, that's a good mana base. Alright, so for blue we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Sure. Nine blue. Black we have one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine, nine. Green, we have <clears throat> one, 
to who? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we can add a green, probably add a black. Whatever. I mean, it's fine. It's 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 okay. We just dropped down to zero kilobytes numerous times in one stream. Uh, we've dropped sixty four percent of the frames, and I have to splice three videos together. Totally simple. Totally. Uh... Well, there were sixty six issues in the past twenty four hours a second ago. Now there's two hundred and two reports. So. It seems like it might be a spectrum issue. But, I mean, what are you going to do? <laughs> oh lord good times I mean, ideally, once we splice the videos, though, we still have a, a video. Because the game itself is not actually being affected, interestingly enough. You got it. The top three cards you'll ever put one in your hand, the rest in the graveyard. Okay. The top three cards you'll ever put one into your hand, and the rest in the graveyard. The top three cards you'll ever put one of them into your hand, and the rest into your graveyard. Is this the same exact card? Interesting. Yeah, it's the exact same card. That's fascinating. Fascinating. Uh, I'll take the land. You just gonna chump block it? I would chump block. I always chump block. I'm just gonna give me the card. I feel like every single draft we've done. Yeah, it's probably unwatchable like this. This is unbelievable. I feel like every single draft we've done, uh, we've played against the the exact the, the mirror match in round one. I mean, I'm not saying they're Sultai, but like they're clearly blue black graveyard themed. Wow, we both have strategic planning only they have strategic planning and ransack how am i doing i'd be doing a lot better if i did not have to deal with this shit internet so i don't know what this is so i'm gonna find out what it is uh sort of yeah so it just kills the thing that's pretty good No hits. 
sad. Oh, no attacks. Okay, I could really use some lands here. Okay, that's helpful. All right, well, one more land. That's what we're looking for here. quality. <laughs> oh, Lord. Sure. a seven mana skin render that's a three one instead of a three three. Oh good we didn't tap this guy. That's good. I'm glad I'm really distracted by the internet. Wow now it's up to thirteen thousand kilobytes. That's insane. Twelve thousand wow Yep, 11,000. That's, that's something right there. What are we what are the odds they have a counter spell here? 1 2 3 4 5 6 duplicate. Let's get rid of this guy. Think twice, sure. Don't think twice. We have dropped sixty four percent of the Problems with Spectrum. Spectrum is having issues since 11.40 a.m. Eastern in the zip code areas between mine. Hmm. Well, that explains it, I guess. I hope.
Oh wow, it's in the green now though. So that's interesting. Did we just actually stabilize? Both in game and in in bits? I think we might have just stabilized. Return a non uh sure. Well, now I'm just going to play this for two so I can tap this guy down. Because taking two is better than taking four. That's just basic math, guys. Guys, I think we did it. I think we're okay. I mean, I could be wrong, but... Feeling okay right now. We're in the green. Boy, that was a real, that was a real nightmare. Do they have six cards left in their library? I don't understand. How are they winning this? Do they have a Laboratory Maniac? Discard two. Sure. I'll discard the non-Dragonlord Sylvangar cards. You got it. Uh, maybe we take this guy, actually. I don't know what this is, but this is just a 4-3, which we can get through. Or tap down forever. I'm more interested in taking this creature. Because I don't know what it is. It could be a boat. Uh, it costs extra up oh, now we just now we're down in the red again uh, it costs extra when you when you target this with spells not with not with effects and now the internet's back again it's choppy again sorry guys bane of the living sure for how much uh, it doesn't matter <laughs> I think they just wanted to flip it so that we wouldn't have the option to do so I mean, when you have six cards in, in your library, I'm pretty okay with having no cards in hand. They should they should think they should chemistry's insight here and think twice. Unless they have a laboratory maniac in their deck, in which case, in which case, don't do that. Yep, we are now in... Yep. Obviously not your fault, guys. Definitely a, an internet issue. Oh, maybe that was a better one? Who knows? Greekwood Ghoul. One, two, three, four, five. That's actually pretty good. One, two, three, four, five. Doesn't really do much though. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So if they have 17 lands. Oh, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Oh, there's only three then. That's much different. So there's three lands in these seven cards. Are we going to be able to get through before they do? I don't think so. Like, they just block here. They go to 10. Yeah, that's fine. We're just going to pass here. Wow, that's sad. The creek would have felt, felt like it was going to be pretty decent there.
being able to just exile their things multiple multiple times. Like, I mean, they're probably not going to be casting them. That's not really the point. The point is just gaining a life and having a 3-3 on the board, which is pretty nice. Uh, can't you meld them out with memory? No, because it shuffles in, doesn't it? Shuffle their hand in the graveyard in the library and draw seven. Then they just get their deck back. It's not like Wheel of Fortune where you're just drawing seven. Man, what a false what a false beacon of hope. Destroy all dragon creatures. Okay, but then we get back this. Okay. So three for two for one? Sure. I guess we'll take two here. Totally fine. There's look, there's my free card that you got to play. Oh boy. Alright. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Fights a creature I don't control. This these are mediocre. This guy is the only one with a really decent ability. And it's ours, so. Let's just pass. Three or three. They have one card in their library. They have to win with the four cards they have available to them. Four, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. They don't have enough to flash it back this turn. Uh, I will let you through if you want. I will eat your guys. Or four, so we can deal with four things. Dan's, what's going on, buddy? Our internet connection is absolutely terrible. So, unfortunately, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, cast. And we'll just pass. We'll let you draw your card. Hope you don't have, like, Lab Maniac. If you go Lab Maniac, think twice, I'd cry. And we just win the game. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, well, the lesson to be learned here is uh, don't mill yourself. Internet connection, why? We can take the naturalists out for this guy. We didn't actually I don't think we saw anything that actually this targets. Um I do kinda like stubborn denial here, but they have a lot of creatures. I 
Why do they discard a card? Are they discarding their own cards? I don't think so. But we do have Silent Spectre to kind of facilitate that. So that's kind of cool. Whoop, sorry. Unless you guys didn't hear that, in which case, I'm not sorry. Everything else seems good. I don't think we're actually like... Man, Tripnews actually did some work there. Yeah, I think our deck is actually good. Are we out of the woods yet? Are we out of the woods yet? Are we out of the woods? Uh, I'm going to keep this hand. Filigree Familiar is fine. We also have lands that we can cast everything with, so... I mean, I've kind of been, like, spoiled in this format where I'm like, well, I just want to keep my lands. As long as I can cast my spells, I think it's fine. Yes. Excellent. One, two, three, four. And we're probably going to kill this Talranith next. Shuffles their graveyard into their... Nice. Okay, that's actually fine. We have dropped for those for those watching on Twitch. We have dropped twenty nine thousand frames. Yavamaya Coast? Where did that come from? No attacks. Alright, this is... Okay, everybody's into the red zone. Well, we're definitely blocking Talarand. That was interesting. Tombstalker, sure. One, two, three, four. We can actually. Yeah, we're just going to commit this guy. One, two, uh, two, three, four. Attack you for a bajillion. And 
and then probably just play air and block this guy. I feel like right now we're just trying to prevent damage here. They didn't play what was in their hand. So it's got to like bounce this guy perhaps? Yep. Bane for four. Sure. Uh, Thousand Winds face down. Solemn Simulacrum. So we have blue, blue, green, green, black, black, black. Probably another blue. And now they're going to draw Tomb Stalker, I assume. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cast it. We kill it with this guy. Yep. This game's been a bloodbath. Uh, bottom. Three, four, five. I mean, let's just let's just end it, right? Put you to two, which is even if you kill this guy and get this guy back, it's still lethal. So, I'm not sure what you could even have here. <laughs> the digging is so real good games good games loud. Uh, yeah, that's keepable. Keep a blay. starting with now. Three lands that are in the battlefield tapped, unfortunately. Oh, we do have a three drop and a four drop, which is great. I'm going to bottom you because we don't need a fifth land here. So, I guess we'll go Colosseum. Oh, Water Grave. Okay, that's good. That's good. We'll play the lands that, lands that always enter the battlefield tapped rather than the lands that sometimes enter the battlefield tapped. Swamp entered the battlefield. Wow. Or in the, uh, entered, the, entered the auto zone. Get in the zone. 
AutoZone. Uh, we're just going to get a stomping ground here. Yes. One, two, three. Face down. Yeah, you guys are probably gonna have to refresh, and it doesn't even matter. the The bit rate right now is. Did they steal our guy? Wow, that's messed up. Uh, fudge. Oh, Jesus. I feel like we just have to kill around Sagu Mauler because otherwise they flip it next turn and then it's just the most miserable thing ever. So now I'm wishing we played this instead, but what can you do? Oh, God, this is so bad. I mean, them flipping Sagu Mahler is just the worst thing that they could do, though. Sure. Five mana? No, we're just going to go Solemn, grab a Forest, play Dismal Backwater. And we do have Find to get back Sagamaller and Dragonlord Silumgar, which is pretty sweet. Unless they end up making us discard cards somehow, which has been very common in this cube. Okay. Well, we're definitely stealing that. Or that. Well, we're probably just going to steal that. One, two, three, four... Five, six. Tassiger, or uh, Silumgar stealing Tassiger is just the best you can get as far as flavor. I mean, I'm sure they'll have an answer to, to Silumgar, but if we can hit one land, we can go find find into okay well that's interesting thank you cobra laser face thank you so much for the reset buddy welcome back welcome back really appreciate it even though the stream has been hot trash today okay so none of these cards are uh, super dangerous for us Let's do this. Sure. I think we're just one. I think we're just keeping men up so we can actually activate uh, Tassiger twice. That seems really strong. Just draw two cards. We're just going to block here. He's not doing us any good, and this attack kind of says, like, I'm not going to be blocking, so...
probably going to give us Ruthless Ripper. It seems like the most innocuous card they can give us. Solemn Simulacrum. Interesting. Wow, Trip News? Wow. They have underestimated Trip News. Sure, sure. Oh, yeah, sure. So we have a lot of mana here. We want to get rid of the Tasker. They don't have enough mana to activate it, which is great for us. It might just be duplicate on Tasker. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then we have three mana left over, so we can still play Trip Noose. Oh, not that. Oh, no, we're playing that. Duplicate, duplicate. Four, five, six. Or we can actually just find here. Let's get back Sagu and Solomgar. Actually, I don't know if I do like that. <laughs> because I want to be able to keep that a surprise. So we'll just play Trip News here. Like, if we just get back Solomgar, they're never going to play anything good into it. I'd rather just have them play good things into it. Sure. I'd also rather get <laughs> um, a duplicate back, so. Find, duplicate, and Solomgar. Interesting, but you know I have Silumgar, right? Alrighty then. That should do it, right? What does this do? Uh, tap a non-land permanent that permanent doesn't untap. Yeah, that's pretty good. Alright. Okay. Well, whatever this is, is is this the is this a voracious hydra of their own? Yeah. Uh, as long as you control it, no, we're gonna one, two, three, four. Seems good. Huh. Well, that is a thing, isn't it? Hmm. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. We can actually kill this guy for six. One, two, three, four, six. I don't think it hurts to strategic planning here. Let's see what our options are. Callus dismissal seems good. Um. One, two, three, four. Five, six. Join. Uh, tap. Tap your blue sources. Oh, non land permanent, sure. I don't know why it's a seven mana card. Like being able to tap down your lands doesn't seem like a super broken proposition, but. All 
Our deck is pretty sweet. I don't know if you guys knew that. Do we have things that return things to our hand? Summer now seems great, so does Dive Down. They have ways to steal our things. Take out Ruthless Ripper. Why is the stream lagging? Because my internet is terrible right now, that's why. Why else would it be lagging? Yeah, we can just hit 41. I accept 41. So now the question is, do we trip noose on two? Probably. Um, because I play a thing next turn, we're not gonna be able to activate trip noose too. So we might as well just play trip noose. We also don't have any three drops to be playing, so. Elk Tears, what's going on, my dude? Kadeen, how you doing? You guys probably aren't going to get these replies because it's super, super, super laggy. And my internet is actually hot trash right now. But That's you, boy. Always yield to this, miss, this, this ability. That will never happen again. Oh, my God. I'm getting so distracted. Like, it's just hard to concentrate when the stream is like shit because I'm just like, I'm worried about the quality and I'm like, so if we die at zero, exactly zero, then I'm going to feel real, real silly. Nomad Outpost is interesting, white and red, huh? All right. Let's try this again. Sure. What's this? Are you going to gain control of this? No, you're going to Ojitai. Sure. Interesting. That seems great. Oh, I guess you're splashing the Ojitai off of like your white mana or your prophetic prism, which seems great. I'm totally down with that. This is also fine. We also get to play a Muldratha. Uh, I guess we'll attack first, right? Wow. 
sad. Gray. Got Ralclaw Mystic. That was that was the most unoffensive card there. That's pretty interesting. One, two, three, four, five, six. We get to keep this and this up. Seven, eight, nine. I really don't want them activating Tasker twice a turn, though. That's pretty bad. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Actually, we can't do both. We can play this guy face down. One. Two, three. Vicious offering something. Callus dismissal. This. Oh, actually, I like this. Here, we'll do this. Oh yes, that's sick. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Six mana, huh? Seven mana, huh? Well. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Nope, don't want to do that. Probably Creekwood, right? Just start exiling things. Man, Trip News gonna be doing some work again. Rattleclaw Mystic hitting the bin, I bet. Can we have another match after this? Mountain instead. Yeah, I guess mountains. It's gonna be worse than a creature. That's pretty good. Okay, so they have no cards in hand. Good to know. Good to know. Okay, that's pretty nice. We could fight this, but it's ours. One, two, three, four, five. We're gonna do this for three. We're just gonna kill the dragon scale elite. General, whatever it's called. And then keep up Trip News because we don't want to get hit by this. Uh, Fights you. Oh, wow. So we can commit our own guy, which is not terrible. They have no cards in hand. We can also just eat their graveyard. Return a creature 
creature. Sack a creature, return a creature from your graveyard to your hand. I mean, that's what we want to do, right? Being able to sack this guy to return Muldrotha and then just replay it next turn is pretty nuts. I imagine they're going to flip our guy. Because they have nothing else, nothing else to do. Yep. Fascinating. I'll allow it. Is this not a sorcery, right? Okay, cool. Um. Thank you. Yes, we're just gonna tap down this guy as usual. Bulamog, thanks so much for the resub, even though the internet is hot shit right now. Really appreciate it. Let's get rid of a Tassiger one. Nope, that's not going to do it. It's going to be black and... One, two, three, four, five. Now we can start using... Ya boy. Destroys the trip noose. Okay. One, two, three, four. That's annoying. It's a great draw. <laughs> Actually. What if we take a hit here? We sacrifice... Hold on. One, two, three, four. We sack this to... It goes to the hand, right? So we play Muldroth the next turn. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can replay Trip Noose. We're going to take another hit. So we're taking 12 total. Fascinating. Yeah, I'll just take two here. And let's get rid of this, because it's a scary card. And... Oh, the game is in. <laughs> Alright, that'll do it, I guess. Wow, that's pretty nuts. Yeah, that's an engine right there. Okay. Well, we are 4-0 right now on this terrible... I don't know if we are back. I have no faith in that. This hand is something, huh? I'm going to mulligan this hand because we can't cast anything. This I will keep. We can get a watery grave with this, which is nice. Gives us all our colors. Well, 
let's keep uh, put a card on the bottom I'll get rid of duplicate he's expensive We'll get a water grave because then we can cast strategic planning on turn two. Hmm. Actually, I don't know if we want strategic planning here. I think we just play stomping grounds. Um, the reason being, we don't know what we want to look for. Like the the best thing about strategic planning or ponder or brainstorm or cards like that is that they let you dig for answers. And if you don't know what you're getting, you're just getting the random best card. There's no real reason to even do it. This guy's basically a morph, right? <laughs> We don't even have another black card, so we can't even flip this. Okay. Actually, Hydra seems good here. Hail Hydra. Just going to play this. So this guy's going to be a 3 next turn. But we need him to be a 4 instead. Can you be a 4 instead of a 3? That's fucking unbelievably strong. That's insane. Wow, two prophetic bolts. <sighs> Don't even wait. Let's get a second green here. Uh, yeah, that's fine. It was a timely expunge we hit. Oh, we get to draw a card. So do they. Oh well. Conclave Naturalists. Is the stream finally working? I don't know. It's up to like 11,000 kilobytes a second. It's not a reasonable amount of, of data. Wow. You got the Kaikar and the Tigam. That's something. Land? Not a land. You're good. Thank you. Lamagoy, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. this just works I'm gonna be real pressed oh wow that just worked we got rid of both of these legendary idiots that's great way to go big dumb idiot cards
haste, huh? That's interesting. I guess we're getting aggressive here. Um, well, gee. Do we just Sidisi here? Puts more power on the board with this guy next turn. They're going to 13. We can go 6 of 8, 9. That's a lot of damage. I'm actually going to play... We're going to play Sidisi here because if we... Uh, blue, green, black. Because if we draw land, we can play either two morphs. Or duplicate. Duplicate looking a little better here. Okay, it looks, it looks like we're in the green again now, so I have no idea, man. This stream is something else. Well, now they're going to play a spell immediately so they can get a 2-2 out of it. Solid value. Hmm. To the surprise of no one. Take four. All right. I actually think I just want to duplicate this guy. One, two, three, four, five, six. I love when duplicates like, would you like to use this ability? I'm like, yeah, I would. Thanks. That's a good card. Um, target spell? Yeah, we'll keep that on. No, we actually want another land, don't we? One, two, three. No, we actually have seven. Yeah, we can keep that on top. That seems great. That was our seventh land. All right, well, Quicksilver Dragon deals five, puts us to five. Let's hope we don't die. What? I think these basics look great on here. These are insanely... Look at these. These look fantastic. What are you talking about, wonky? You're, you're out of your mind. You're out of your llama goyfin mind. No blocks. I have one card in hand. Okay. No. Okay. Interesting. This is actually a really good block by them. I was not expecting it. But we get to bounce this. Oh boy, that's terrible. Wow, this actually is terrible for us. If they blocked here, it'd be great, because we can just flip and deal a ton of damage. I think we should have thought this through. Actually, no, this is actually fine, right? They take a billion. One, two, three, four. We can play Trip Noose. And then just tap this dude down. Yeah, that's actually totally fine.
Oh, Llama Glyph, that sounds terrible, buddy. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I've known friends with Crohn's, and they definitely had some pretty rough moments. So, wait, how do they... How are they not dead here? Uh, okay. But can I tap one of these guys down and kill you? I'm no expert, but... I'm kind of an expert. Okay, okay. He's like, maybe they won't see it. No, he saw it. He saw the line. Even if we didn't tap down, we still just get to Sagu Mauler them, so. Okay, well. Definitely want Stubborn Isle and probably Dive Down as well. They have a bunch of spells. Uh, Ruthless River can come out again. Maybe. Hmm. We didn't see anything for Naturalists. Let's keep Ruthless Ripper in and take out the Naturalists. Um, it's keepable. It's not great, but it's keepable. So, maybe that's good enough. That made it better. Fascinating. Yeah, now we're just going to play backwater. Take two. Take three. Well, take two, essentially, because we gained a life. And then... I think it's because it's a poop disease. <laughs> oh, that's likely. That is definitely uh, a possibility. For sure. Well, that's just rude. Now you're just being rude. Wow. Can a dude get a lane? We're going to Vicious Offering this guy, because I don't know what it is. Wow, that was a good, <laughs> solid dude to hit. land not a land one two three actually we have dive down maybe we just play this face up keep up dive down or stubborn denial that seems better than dealing two damage here uh yeah the cube has been enjoyable i've actually had a good time with it i would definitely recommend it They have one card in hand? That seems good for us. Are we trade? No, no trades. Still no lands either. Um, actually, here's what we're gonna do. 
Let's dismiss this callously. Sure. Give it hex proof. Uh, when it's turned face up, you copy target instance value and choose a new targets for that copy. Man, they still get to play that guy though. That's really sad. Nicely done. Nicely done. Go to five, I guess. Play a Sadisi. Go to four, I guess. Hope I hit a creature. And we did. Two creatures. I mean, theoretically, this could be stabilizing. How much was the Quainar? Was that guy? Three, three? Exhausting. This is exhausting. Yep, that's that's amazing. That's actually incredible. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, missed four land drops. All right. Well, it's still nothing that Conclave Naturalist cares about. I worked six hours last night in my second job. I have to work another seven tonight. Coffee, you are my friend. I will be leaving soon. Got to follow up practice with my son. Hopefully, he can watch you work so I can stay awake and be entertained. That's okay with me. I appreciate it. Let's. I will play first. All right, this is a keeper. This is a keeper if I ever saw a keeper. And I've seen a keeper before. I'm going to bottom this for now. This guy's got some expensive abilities, but they're good in the late game. And now they're never good. Now they're good at no point in the game of magic. Now they're good again. We want a second blue for this guy. But we also want a second green for like Voracious Hydra, so it's kind of awkward. It seems like it's back, but I mean, I'm really reluctant even. I think we get a second blue right now because we need a second blue. But we can also just like. 
I think we're just playing this guy now. If we draw another land, I don't think the two damage is that important. But if we want to, if we draw another another land, I, I really want to be able to connect with this guy. So. Our hand seems pretty solid. No blocks. I value these guys very highly. Tygam. Talrand. Talrando Calrissian. No, land one time. That's a good one. Do you not get to attack with this guy? I mean, is this a decent trade? Probably. Especially with Muldrotha, I think it's fine. Yeah, that's totally fine. Yeah, ripping two cards out of your hand is just insane. Oh, there's the Tygam and the Mischievous Quainar, so now we know that's not the dude on the board. Yep, still no blocks. Oh, you can flip it. What does this do? When it deals damage, you may sacrifice if you gain control of target creature player controls. Sure, I'll callous dismissal my own guy. I accept that. Deals no combat damage, right? No, it still deals combat damage. Well, biscuits. Scargy McMargy. All right. Well, I'll just pass here. This guy's great because you can start shooting things, but then I can just cast things from the graveyard. So that's cool, too. Burn a fucking way. Come on, dude. Wow. What actual shit. That is insanely infuriating. But I guess we get to flip our guy. I don't know, man. That's terrible. Wow. Come on. Oh, wow. Okay. Um... Wow, Dragonlord, Silmagar, Mystic Snake, and our Find Finality, which is unfortunate. So our Maldrotha and our Find Finality are in the graveyard. Yep. That's pretty rough. <laughs> well, that's not nearly as bad as this guy, which can shoot our things. They would 100% block here. They'd take 5. That doesn't seem great. Can you stop playing 5-5s five and cards that deal six damage to my team because that would be great I didn't know you streamed wow I've streamed for like four or five years how do I get it how do I get that out there how do I let you know then because I post it on Facebook I post it on Twitter I post it in my articles that I write I actually have no idea how to let people know I stream if they don't know that's crazy to me I feel like I've done literally everything I could possibly do I also feel like this game is slowly getting away from us. <laughs> I 
Where were you last turn when they got their card back? That's the question I'm asking. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, one, two, three, five. I mean, I guess they kill Silent Spectre. Bye bye again, graveyard. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, yeah, so we can go blue, this one, this one, familiar. <sighs> yeah, like attacking just doesn't do anything for us because of the five, five. What we really want is like a duplicate. Um. Literally a duplicate actually would be fantastic. The cards they've exiled is pretty insane, and I hate that it's game three, so there's no really. Yeah, they're just going to do that again because otherwise I exile it, which would have been great. I would have loved to do that, but here we are. Whatever. I'm not going to hold lands at this juncture. They're all good for us. I also don't... There's no reason to attack with uh, Sadisi either, because I don't want to really start milling my <laughs> my creatures. Breadstick, glad to hear it, man. Glad to hear it. I'm a big fan of your food. Sure. Actually, maybe we just start ramming our filigree familiar into our opponent. This is a not inconsequential amount of life. Uh, I definitely play Magic Arena. I play a ton of Magic Arena. It's a fantastic client. Yeah, that's pretty good. I guess we're hoping no counterspell. Disdainful Stroke they could have. Ooh, that's brutal if they have a Disdainful Stroke. How do we play around that? I don't think we do.
It is what it is. Oh boy. What is happening right now? Oh. Oh my. No duplicate. Be something terrible. I mean, most of our good stuff is in the graveyard now. Here comes Prophetic Bolt. Targeting the city, see. Sure. You don't kill the 5-6 here or the 3-3? Three, three? Yeah, pump spells aren't super common in this format. As far as I can tell, and especially not in Jeskai. <laughs> Excuse me. I mean, this is a great card. This is fantastic. Fantastic thing to hit. All right, let's see what we're milling here. Oh, duplicate? Uh, it was a duplicate. And a Solemn Simulacrum. That's, I guess that's fine. So they trade Warden, or they, they block here with Warden, and they just take two. Sure. <clears throat> and we're also at 26. And we have a 5-6 on the board. That should be decent. But boy, a prophetic bolt digging four deep is pretty nuts. Burning oil, sure. I hate these flashback spells. Like you just have no, there's no, there's no priority in between for you to get rid of it. So you got it, man. Okay, well we're looking for cards that are not lands here, and yet we find a land. Dragonlord Silumgar is gone. Muldrafa is gone. Find Finality is gone. How many lands do we have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Four lands in the next ten cards. Okay, that's not terrible. I draw this well? Is it possible? Aggressive. 
Oh yeah, this card's fantastic. This card's gonna absolutely destroy us here. Yep, that's not that's not what we're looking for. We also have a stubborn denial still in the deck, I think, which is pretty miserable here. <laughs> Come on. Why do you still have this? Why do you still have more things? <laughs> I feel like he just attacks with everything here, right? It's just brutal for us for us. So. Oh, you just draw another fucking spell. Yeah, you never have, never don't have it, so. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Welp. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Cool. Go to six. Yep. No, you just get in there. Sure. Yeah, there's literally nothing we can draw here, especially not a fucking land. Cool. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on Twitch and Patreon and Manitraders and CoolStuffInc.com. You can find all the links and the promo codes in the description below. And uh, apologies for the internet outages, and I'll see you guys next time. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching.